right, this is a camera check. Let's see how we're doing. Finn, right on, right on cue, Finn's come in. We're going to talk about collars today and uh, interesting learnings that I had. Oh, hi, Magic too. Fantastic. Don't want a goofy poodle with a pedigree. No whiny, wimpy little gooch, don't you see? Great big dog's the only one for me Then I'll be doing all right Well, I got him back when he was just a boy oh, so Way back sweet. then I could pick him what up That's what Finn does And he barely fits <laughs> into my pickup sweater. truck Yeah, but he's doing all right So we were at a little uh, pet expo down in Columbus a while ago and saw a display of uh, pets where they had a stuffed animal of a pet that had gotten hung up on a fence with its collar and uh, simulating what like a strangulation could look like. So they convinced me to buy these collars and their mission really is to make sure no dog ever uh, gets strangled. So the company's called PetSafe. Actually paid for these collars. We got the extra large 22 to 34 inch neck. And uh, PetSafe is really about safe pets and happy owners, protect, teach, love. So this is actually a breakaway collar, and I'll show you how that works here in a second. Right, boys? I have ready helpers, and uh, they really like to be on camera, as we can see. So here's an old collar we had. Aw, and this one was for Frederick, our second Great Dane. But this collar, when you put it on the dog, let's say we put it on Finn, it's not a breakaway. Uh, it's an Orvis collar. But if he were to get caught on anything, and the example they like to show is a fence, imagine if the collar got hung up there that it could strangle the dog. And the other thing is it, when the dogs are wrestling or playing or you know, getting after each other, um, you could see that it could possibly cause a problem. So instead of this kind of collar, not that collar, We've got the breakaway collar. Come on, I get nervous when I use, I'm sure my viewers get nervous when we use scissors around you guys because you're sniffing everything. So let's get it all off of there. Hang on, wait. Finn, Finn wants to eat it. All right, Finn, you can have that one. I'll work on this one. Okay, Finn, I'll take this one. Finn's a big helper. see that, eh? Can I do this, please? This is a breakaway collar. Leave me alone. Okay, hi, Magic. Yes, yes, I know. You're both going to get collars. Don't worry. Ugh. I didn't think it would be this hard. Getting there. I gotta get it down to like 22 inches. Your necks are 22 inches. Mmm. Okay, Finn, we're gonna take this off of you. So, in the house, we've been leaving this training collar and leash on Finn while we're with him. You never wanna have him out of your sight with this on because that's a definite hazard. But when it's on, he tends to leave magic alone. Without it, he's just harassing him nonstop and wrestling. So, let's put the collar on Finn. There we go. Okay, collar's on, nice and loose. And the great thing is on this one, if he were to get stuck, it peels right off. But so now it goes back together and you've got a collar that they can wear. It's got a little clip for their tags to attach, so like their rabies tags or their name, if they were to get loose. But if they're out and they get loose and something happens, here it is, the PetSafe brand. This will release. And that's the safety mechanism you want. I thought, well, how could I possibly do that and take them, you know, for a walk? So, <laughs> you want it on Magic? Okay, Magic's perfect. So here's what you do. When you're ready to take them for a walk, you actually just go ahead and you clip through 
both this and side able... and this side, and it. then and so now you've got a you have all the strength you need for a walk. When you let them loose, you've got the safety release collar. So I hope you see what I'm trying to demonstrate there. But there we go. Okay, you want it on? All right. Finn just put it on himself. But Finn, I have to adjust it. Very nice collars, boys. All right, so Finn's looks a little tight. Let me fix that. <laughs> Finn! All right, Finn, here you go, ready? They think they're going for a W-A-L-K, I don't even want to say it. Finn, come. Good boy. There. Now that's a little looser. And we can simply put the leash through here and we're good. But if we need to, it breaks away. Finn, come. Finn, you want your collar on? Oh, good boy. So this is the company. It's PetSafe. They're trying to avoid strangulation for your dog. I showed you how these things work. Uh, and it is vet recommended. And really, even just dogs playing around could result in them getting tied up and tangled and could be a real problem. So this is not a sponsored video. Uh, it is uh, really just something that made sense to me when I saw it. So I paid, I think, $30 per collar for this. And uh, I think it's an important thing to be aware of so that your dog would never get caught up and strangled uh, by a collar. So you can find them at PetSafe.net or call them 800-732-2677. I don't know if they're carried in retail stores, but I'm sure you could uh, work it out on their uh, website how to deal with it. So I'll put a link in the description. Uh, let me know what you think. Um, so when you combine this with the Kurgo safety harnesses when you're in the car, this makes sense from a, a not getting the dog uh, choked, but still able to wear a collar that can show dog tags. I think it makes sense. So that's the quick video for this Wednesday. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. If you are, please subscribe, give us a like, hit the notification bell. We try and upload on weekends and Wednesdays. We don't always make it, but we did today. So have a great day. Great day in the neighborhood. Why can't every dog be just as good?